Hi, this is Oz Live, and I am uh, out at George Washington Park. I think you could probably, I don't know if you could see it, but you could probably hear the music, because the music is, <laughs> the music is pretty loud, but, and it's kind of funky. Um, I basically, uh, I just ran into this thing. I was just kind of doing my regular nightly walk at George Washington Park. And uh, I saw him setting up for this like um, for a while, like for about two nights. And uh, I wasn't sure what was going on, but it looks pretty festive as you can see out there. It looks really festive and cool. And they're playing some really like different music, like with an accordion. And it's right by the lion. You guys have seen a lot of lion shots from me, so. But it's right by the lion. There's a stage down there. They got it all like decked out. They got it, you know, they put on a real show here. We'll go and we'll see if we can see them. They're gonna start, they're playing like a, it's kind of a weird jam, like Polish and funk and like stuff like that mixed together. So as you can see, there's like lots of this, they got stalls set up over there uh, on all sides of the street. By a composer and accordionist in Brazil named Sibuca. And so this it's is the lady. Which means a sound for Jobim. At some point, I'm going to find out what the name of this function is. You see, you see the kind of music they play? It's funky. I got to get you to... Uh, I got to get you a closer look at these guys.
because of this, you catch the roots of all these um, rhythmic styles and stuff all across from um, the Caribbean to Brazil to the United States. Just go back at you. Word, a little, okay, Professor. Word, <laughs> take that. <laughs> there you go. It's, 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 you got a thread, you know? Absolutely, sir. No, so that was, I just kind of ran into that show. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> oh my God, that was awesome. Those guys are, it's very good. So we'll kind of walk around here and um, see what they're up to. Uh, see what some of these stalls are. Okay, we're going to the stall area. So as you can see, this is Baltimore, folks. This is George Washington Park. I'm always out here reporting, talking to you guys. And so this is it. This is totally it here. But I don't know what they're selling. I'm trying to uh, see what they're selling. But it's a typical, like, like, start a summer art fair like it's kind of like that and um, every city has them actually <laughs> you can see this and there's flowers oh, there's like spring is here so you gotta have flowers you gotta have those and this is a stall here and there's the infamous George Washington monument that I always show you guys. It's cobblestone streets, as you can see. And uh, and they have it all blocked off. And they have this fair. And it looks like fun. There's a few <laughs> stages. This is another stage here. This looks like a main stage. I don't know. But we'll go over there and see. Yeah, see? It's the... Uh, it's not a stage, it's like oh, an education tent, so that's that. And they put these flowers out here in the front. You see how they arranged them like that? And uh, people are just having a wonderful time. And this, this boulevard in four directions, all four directions, is, uh, there's George. George, that's his base right there. And he goes way up <laughs> into the heavens. <laughs> You see that, like that, so, yeah, so that's what's up. And lots of plants, I think that's what they're pushing. There's the church, you know that church I show you guys all the time? There it is right there. Yeah, it is right there. And they have these, like, uh, things in the air. They kind of make it festive. You see all four directions, there's blocked off, there's music, there's fun. And this is my, actually, this is my um, nightly walk. It just so happens that, you know, as one season turns into another, um, they set up events. And that's what this is, basically. So, yeah, that's what this is. And now uh, we're going to go into another section of the park here. Nope. And, uh, yeah, it goes down. There's people sitting around, uh, drinking, <laughs> and uh, eating and drinking and stuff. So, yeah, that's what's up. You know, it's unfortunate, but they took down the, uh, they had beautiful flowers here, like, like not too long ago, and then one day it was there, and the next day it was all gone. They just took it down, and they put these little ones in there. You know, these little ones, like right there. These, they were tall, and like, they had a flower at the top. You see them, I don't know, I forgot the name of them, but. They're in Holland a lot. Holland, Scandinavian countries. They grow a lot of them. So, and this thing keeps going down. And I'm gonna take you guys with me. Oh, see, it extends. Um, 
I mean, there's the, the statue I always show you guys right there. That's it. I got to tell you the history behind that statue. <laughs> And it may be it may be fascinating. And so it ends up here, right there. It ends. And um and then the regular street. I don't even know if you could I don't know if you could I don't know if those streets are open beyond this thing here. I don't know. But this turned out to be an interesting walk today. I mean, that's how it happens. Now it's it's springtime. It's like late spring. Summer is coming pretty quick. And uh, so they have all these events to announce to the folks that, hey guys, it's summertime. We can have fun again. Especially this year because, because um, the uh, lockdown has been lifted for the first time in two years. So people have effectively been in jail for two years. And this is the first summer where there's no restrictions. Everything is open. You, almost, you really don't have to wear a mask. I haven't seen a lot of places where you have to wear a mask or anything. So that's... So this summer is gonna be particularly uh, uh, energized in a real way just because this is the first time there's no lockdown so yeah you could see it's it's blocked down there it's blocked the whole street and um, this way that seems to be open on there i don't know but i'm going on my nightly walk and we'll see where we end up i'll probably stop at my favorite jazz bar and get a pinot grigio as I always do, so we'll see how that works. <laughs> yeah, oh, these gals are pretty cool. <laughs> now that was cool. 